Hello and welcome back everyone. Today we are going to see the remarkable transformation of the film Saw 2 cast. The film was released in 2005. Let's see how they have changed in these 17 years. I will tell you their real name and age and how they looked then and now in 2022. Before we start, please subscribe to our channel and hit the bell icon so you never miss any upload. Please give us a like for this video, it would only take a few seconds of yours, but it will help us a lot. Michael Marks is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. He serves as a minor character in Saw 2, Saw 4, and Saw 3D. Michael Marks was a young man who was addicted to drugs. After his abduction, an accomplice of Jigsaw, he performed surgery on the young man, during which he placed a key behind Michael's right eye. This key would later become the only way for Michael to save himself from one of Jigsaw's traps, a so-called death mask. About two hours after the surgery, Michael finally woke up and immediately panicked when he saw his bloody, swollen eye in a small mirror. When he jumped up from the chair and screamed for help, a TV turned on in front of him, and a mechanical ventriloquist puppet appeared on screen. Upon seeing an X-ray of his head, Michael realized that the key to the mask was hidden in his orbital cavity. Within 60 seconds, he had to cut out his eye to obtain the key. He was portrayed by Canadian actor Noam Jenkins. Officer Daniel Rigg is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. He serves as one of the main protagonists of Saw 4 and a supporting protagonist in Saw 2 and Saw 3. Daniel Rigg had a temperamental and focused personality. Combined with his strong sense of justice, these traits occasionally caused him to act aggressively when he feared that a criminal might escape their punishment. Sometimes, Rigg even turned violent in such situations, which brought him into conflict with the Internal Affairs Department. Although Rigg was a very self-confident individual, he became more introverted and self-reflective after Eric's disappearance. Around this time, he became obsessed with his urge to save and protect everyone around them. He was portrayed by Jamaican-Canadian actor Lyric Bent. Lyric Bent was 26 years old then. He is now 43 years old. Detective Allison Carey is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. She serves as the secondary protagonist of Saw 2 and a supporting protagonist in Saw and Saw 3. Allison Carey was a hard-working detective who dedicated most of her life to her work. Therefore, she neglected any interpersonal relationships and eventually lost contact with her family. While spending so much time at crime scenes and in other situations related to death, Carrie began to prefer the presence of a cold body over that of a living human being, causing her to become emotionally numb to a certain extent. She was also kind of selfish as she had an affair with her partner, Eric Matthews, even though she probably knew he was married. Carrie was eager to solve the Jigsaw case and was always anxious to stay in control of the investigation. However, she was also capable of stronger feelings for other people. She was portrayed by American actress Dina Meyer. Dina Meyer was 36 years old then. She is 53 years old now. O.B. Tate is a fictional character from the Saw franchise as well as a minor antagonist in Saw 2. Obi was a very immoral man, not hesitating to harm or defraud the people around him for the sake of his own goals. Due to this, he didn't get along well with others and rather lived as a lone wolf. He was also hard to frighten, as seen by his reaction to Xavier Chavez's threats to kill him. His behavior during Laura Hunter's abduction also leads to the assumption that Obi had some kind of sadistic tendencies. He was portrayed by Canadian actor Timothy Bird. Timothy Bird was 50 years old then. He is 67 years old as of now. Gus Collyard is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. He serves as a minor character in Saw 2, Saw 4, and Saw 5. Despite being a businessman, Gus Collyard was highly vulnerable to stress. When put under pressure, he tended to act nervously, as seen when he woke up after his abduction and discussed the situation with his fellow prisoners. However, he also had a more aggressive side. 
when losing his temper, he even occasionally turned violent. An example of such a situation was his conflict with Cecil Adams at the Homeward Bound Clinic. Due to his drug addiction, it could be assumed that his aggressive behavior was partly caused or worsened by withdrawal symptoms. He was portrayed by Canadian actor Tony Napo. Tony Napo was 37 years old then. Now he is 54 years of age. Laura Hunter is a fictional character from the Saw franchise as well as a supporting protagonist in Saw 2. Laura was a very insecure and, to a certain point, mentally unstable young woman. Due to this, she seemed to be very shy and wasn't able to handle stressful situations well. She easily took fright and even suffered an emotional breakdown during the events occurring in the nerve gas house. Besides this, she apparently was a kind-hearted person who generally refused to oppose other people. She was portrayed by American actress and country music singer, Beverly Mitchell. Beverly Mitchell was 24 years old then. Now her age is 41 years. Addison Corday is a fictional character from the Saw franchise as well as a supporting protagonist in Saw 2. Addison was a self-confident woman, not afraid of openly stating her opinion. If someone opposed her, she often reacted in a disrespectful and often sarcastic way. Even in situations of distress, Addison tried to stay calm and think logically and was, therefore, one of the most reasonable prisoners in the house besides Jonas. Due to her strong personality, she was also one of the few people who didn't show their fear of Xavier and even opposed and insulted him on several occasions. She was portrayed by Canadian film and television actress Emmanuelle Vaugier. Emmanuelle Vaugier was 29 years old then. She is 46 years old as of this video. Jonas Singer is a fictional character from the Saw franchise as well as a supporting protagonist in Saw 2. Jonas was probably the most reasonable one among the prisoners of the nerve gas house. Even in situations when he was put under pressure, he tried to stay calm and make up a plan before doing anything rash. However, he was also very pessimistic, evident by his constant doubts on the existence of an antidote for the nerve gas. During his imprisonment, he tried to keep the group together, believing that they had better chances to survive if they cooperated. Despite his usually calm nature, he was also capable to defend himself if necessary and was therefore one of the few prisoners who weren't afraid of Xavier, or at least didn't openly show it. He was portrayed by American film and television actor, Glenn Plummer. Glenn Plummer was 44 years old then. He is now 61 years old. Xavier Chavez is a fictional character from the Saw franchise as well as the tertiary antagonist of Saw 2. Xavier was a choleric and highly aggressive man who was often quick to anger even by the smallest things. Most of the time, he treated the people around him with disrespect and didn't hesitate to threaten and insult him if they refused to follow his orders. Due to his dominant and ruthless personality, he often chose to deal with his problems by violent means and brute force rather than words and arguments. This ruthless behavior ultimately led to his death at the hands of Daniel Matthews. He was portrayed by an American film and television actor, Frankie G. Frankie G was 39 years old then. As of this video, he is 56 years old. Amanda Young, also known as Mandy, is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. Overall, Amanda was the tertiary antagonist of the franchise. Amanda Young was a selfish woman who only cared about fueling her drug addiction to the point where she neglected and even prostituted herself to get a shot. As John was the first person in her life to whom Amanda could relate, the latter quickly became mentally dependent on him and saw him as both a teacher and a father. Despite this, she couldn't withstand the stress of assisting him in his self-imposed mission to test people and soon began to doubt his methods, which caused her to return to her self-harming tendencies. She was portrayed by an American actress and singer, Shawnee Smith. Shawnee Smith is 53 years old as of this video. She was 36 years old at that time. Daniel Matthews, also known as Danny, is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. He serves as a supporting protagonist in Saw 2. 
Daniel Matthews was a rebellious teenager who smarted from his troubled family environment. When his father, Eric, cheated on Daniel's mother, Daniel stayed with the latter and developed a grudge against Eric. Around this time, he committed numerous petty offenses. Due to the strained relationship with his father, it could be speculated that Daniel committed these crimes to provoke Eric. Daniel often acted disrespectfully towards the latter and even implied that he deemed him a bad father. Daniel was a kind-hearted individual. Throughout his captivity, Daniel comforted Laura Hunter, who seemingly had the most trouble dealing with their situation, and had attempted to comfort Laura as the nerve gas was killing her. On another occasion, he was the only one to help Amanda Young after she was thrown into the needle pit by Xavier Chavez. He was portrayed by Canadian actor Eric Knudsen. Eric Knudsen was 17 years old then. Now he is 34 years old. Detective Eric Matthews is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. He serves as the main protagonist of Saw 2 and a supporting protagonist in Saw 3 and Saw 4. Eric Matthews had a temperamental and focused personality. These traits regularly caused him to lose his temper when things didn't go his way. He often acted aggressively and sometimes even turned violent in such situations, which repeatedly brought him into conflict with the Internal Affairs Department. His egoism became apparent when Eric faked evidence in numerous cases and thereby unjustly arrested innocent people who were subsequently convicted. Eric deeply loved his son and was willing to go to great lengths to save him when Jigsaw abducted him. However, he didn't ask for his son throughout Daniel Riggs' game, indicating that Eric had given up his hope that he would ever see Daniel again. He was portrayed by an American singer, songwriter, rapper, actor, record producer, and film producer, Donnie Wahlberg. Donnie Wahlberg was 36 years old when he acted in Saw 2 film. Now he is 53 years old. John Kramer, also known as the Jigsaw Killer or simply Jigsaw, is a fictional character from the Saw franchise. He serves as the primary antagonist of Saw, Saw 2, II, Saw 3, and Saw 4. John Kramer was a diligent and hardworking man who was just as devoted to his wife and his unborn son. When his son died, and John was diagnosed with incurable cancer, the latter suffered from severe depression and turned away from his wife and his work until he eventually tried to commit suicide, but unexpectedly survived. Because of this, John realized that he wanted to live and decided to spend the remaining time of his life testing other people's will, to live in order to convince them to value their lives and the lives of those around them. Over the years, John rallied several disciples around him, who followed his will and continued his games, even after his death. While doing so, he manipulated his accomplices through his charismatic personality and by using their mental instability. He was portrayed by an American actor Tobin Bell. Tobin Bell is now 80 years old. He was 63 years of age back then. Thank you so much for watching our video. Please don't forget to subscribe our channel and hit the bell icon. If you haven't watched Saw 1 video, then click on thumbnail now. My name is Kaylee and I'll see you in the next video soon.